Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm Coco and today we're going to be making some dessert tacos. Now these are really fun to make all together with the family and they, everybody enjoys them. So if you want to learn how to make these, come with me on Cook Love. Okay guys, so the things you're going to need are um, tortillas of course and their flour. We're gonna make um, a buñuelo uh, taco, so you're gonna need cinnamon and sugar, some caramel sauce, some syrup is optional. I'm also gonna make a homemade whipped cream, and I'm gonna make plenty because I use this to put on pancakes for the kids um, for breakfast during the week. So I'm also gonna be showing you how to do that. Heavy cream vanilla and powdered sugar once you make this you'll never go back to buying the stuff at the store and then you're going to need vanilla ice cream any vanilla ice cream will do it's up to you um, but you're going to want to leave it out about maybe five minutes prior to putting it all together so that it's soft enough to scoop okay okay so this is the stuff the kiddos could help with so we're going to start off with about a quarter cup of sugar and in that you can mix some cinnamon, probably about a teaspoon and I let, I let um, the other night when we made this I let my, my son taste it to see what ratio he liked but it's about a quarter cup of sugar to about a teaspoon of cinnamon, okay? You could always add more if you want or less. It's up to you. Okay, that's done. Then the other thing that the kiddos like to help with is the whipping, the whipped cream, which is really fun because they get to use the mixer. So um, I am going to just do a cup of heavy cream. about a teaspoon of vanilla and then this part is optional so I think it's like a quarter cup of confectioner sugar but it's to your taste only because some people like really sweet whipped cream and then some people don't so it's up to you but the thing I do is I make enough so that I can keep it for the week because then we just put a little dollop on pancakes or whatever so I like to save like my mayo jars or you can use a mason jar and just put it in there and it stays in the fridge for a few days and it works great so now we're gonna mix this and I'm gonna go get the mixer and we'll be back okay so I'm gonna mix this and we're gonna make it until it it has peaks And you don't want to over mix it because it'll break apart and it'll it won't have that whipped cream consistency. this is the right one to use but just having one on there seems weird but maybe that is I don't know I just use it so 
Do you see how it stays and it doesn't slide anywhere? And the sugar is good for us. And so now we're gonna just put it in our jar. Okay, so now that it's ready, we're gonna put it in our jar. And this, once you do this, you'll always wanna just have whipped cream around. And you could do it for, you could use a lot of different stuff. You can put strawberries with it, um, put it on ice cream, put it on anything, put it in your coffee. But once you know how to make it, man, the kids don't want it any other way. My son, he knows how to make it. He's the whipped cream making uh, master. Okay. So a cup made about maybe two, three cups of whipped cream. And just keep it in the jar and it's good to go. All right, now we're going to get ready to fry up our shells. Okay, you guys, so for this dessert taco, I got these little tiny flour tortillas. And these are perfect for like about a scoop, a little more than a scoop of ice cream because then it's not so much sugar and stuff. And I'm gonna fry them with canola oil. And we're gonna fry them just like you would a, a buñuelo, but you wanna make it like in a taco shape. So we're just gonna put a little bit of oil, depending on how many you need for your family. And we're gonna get that oil going so that we can fry up our shell. These are so cute. There's a little. Okay, so now that the uh, oil's nice and hot, we're gonna put our, our tortilla in there. And you wanna work fast so that they don't stay flat because you want them to be taco shaped. And I just, I'm not gonna worry too much about it as long as they start getting their shape that they need. And bubbles are good because it just makes it kind of fluffy tasting. These make really warm. <laughs> I remember when my mom would make these when we were kids. We loved them with the big, huge bubble in them. But those are for them to be flat and we want them taco shaped. So you're just gonna try and get them as close to a taco as you can so that you can put some ice cream in here. Look how pretty this looks. And you don't want them too crispy or anything. Just really simple to go through here. And there you go. And you wanna work fast as soon as they come out you want to drain it a little bit, put it over here on your paper towel, and use your cinnamon sugar mixture to um, put on top of it. So here it is. And then I'm just going to Put it inside a little bit, put it back in, then I'm going to get some more, put it on each side, and you want to do it when it's hot, otherwise it won't stick. And there we go, and then I'll just leave it like that, and I'm going to do a close up right now, okay? Okay, so here we go, and we have it all ready to go.
All right. So here it is inside and outside. And now we're going to put our vanilla ice cream in it. Okay, so here's our taco. It's ready to go. It's nice and crunchy. We're going to scoop our ice cream. And this is about a scoop. And I just put it right there. And I'm using this vanilla bean ice cream. Then we're going to drizzle a little bit of this caramel sauce on top. Just a little bit. You don't want to overdo it because it's already really sweet. So we're going to drizzle just a little bit on top. Okay. And then if you want some chocolate syrup, you can also do that. Just a tiny bit. And then we have our whipped cream, which I'll put a little bit of. Oh, I kind of put a little bit too much, but. And then I always, if I use something with cinnamon, I always do a little, little tiny dash of nutmeg. And then here's our dessert taco. And you can always use a little bit more of the sugar if you wanted to sprinkle a little bit of it on okay and here it is okay you guys so here's the dessert taco you know look at this my kids love it your whole family's gonna love it and it's so simple and so here it is look at that whipped cream the ice cream the caramel sauce Mm. They're going to love this. I mean, it's a good dessert just for that. I don't know, maybe a little special occasion or it's your splurge day or whatever. But I'm definitely splurging today. So I hope you enjoy this and you make it. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And come back and see me again. I hope you enjoyed this. And um, leave me a comment below on Cook Love with Coco. Sorry kids, this one's mine. <laughs>